This is Richard Allen at oculusurge.com. This video demonstrates incision and drainage of a lacrimal sac abscess. Imaging shows the dilated lacrimal sac with an abscess that extends down the nasal lacrimal duct. The area is anesthetized, which can sometimes be difficult due to the tight skin from the abscess. You don't want to anesthetize directly into the sac, but around it. A 15 blade is then used to make an incision over the sac. In this case, the abscess is not as superficial as some. The incision should be about one centimeter in length. You can usually palpate the abscess and place your marking over that area. The blade should be directed posterior and medial. In this case, the incision needs to be made a little deeper than usual. At times, you can hit the angular vessel, which you would like to avoid, resulting in brisk bleeding. Cotton-tipped applicators are then used to express the contents of the sac. Purulent material is expressed. This should be sent for culture. A chalazian curette can then be used to disrupt any septations in the abscess to improve drainage. Iodoform gauze should then be used to pack the area, which can be removed in approximately two days.